The clock is ticking. We've got a big challenge in front of us, though, and that's to raise $1.5 million within the next couple of weeks. A couple months ago, an unnamed donor pledged $2 million to the Grand Traverse Bay YMCA if the club raised the remaining $4 million needed by the end of the year. So far, they've raised $2.5 million, a huge mark but still a long ways to go in just 10 days. Oh, if you would have told me a couple of months ago we would had only 1.5 million to go, I wouldn't have thought that was possible necessarily. So yes, definitely, all things are possible and we know we can do this. It's really critical in the next two weeks that we get those last few donations in. Uh, we want to continue to offer and, and add programs that will benefit the community. If they meet their goal, they'll start construction this spring with the first phase. The Aquatic Center, complete with a six-lane competitive pool, splash pad, hot tub, and a lap pool. It will also include a fitness center and indoor tennis courts. 40% of our kids in this area can't swim. 40% in an area surrounded by water. The reason we're not doing more about it now is we simply don't have the facilities in order to teach kids how to swim. So it'll be a huge impact for this community. $1.5 million in just 10 days. A huge feat. A huge reward. A community closer to a brand new place to work out, play, and compete. Your dollars will never uh, mean as much. Right now it counts the most. In Traverse City, Lauren Amstutz, 7 and 4 News.